Hello, I'm Billy Parrott, Managing Librarian of the Picture Collection. I'm going to answer your question. Have you ever noticed interesting ads or fashions in your neighborhood? Or look closely at sets and costumes in a play, television show, or movie? These things are designed by people who look at pictures to get ideas. Many of those pictures come from the picture collection. The collection is located on the third floor of the Mid-Manhattan Library. We have about a million and a half pictures, and we're always getting more because creative people always need new ideas. The pictures come from all sorts of sources. Donations, old books from our own shelves, magazines we subscribe to just for pictures. We take each picture, note where it came from, and record that information in a database in case we need it later. Next, we give the picture a subject heading. That means we decide where to file it in the collection's more than 12,000 subject headings. For example, let's say a picture has two men wearing hats and the date is 1904. We do have a hats and headgear subject heading, so maybe we'd file it there. But wait, suppose the men are leading a donkey ride for two children. Then maybe it should go under animals, donkey, or children playing, or even children 1900s. But wait, that looks like Central Park, which means the picture ideally should go in New York City, Central Park. We get many, many requests for New York City pictures. Once we choose the picture subject heading, we write that in its margin and stamp it with a picture collection stamp. Then we clean it up and put it in an alphabetized sorting tray. In this case, the picture goes in the New York City tray. Later, we come with a collection cart to gather all the pictures. We roll the cart into the collection and file the pictures in their appropriate folders. Now, anyone who needs them can find them.